Good morning, YouTube, and uh, welcome back to the channel. Now we fans up. I'm just playing. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I normally don't shoot a video like this, but I, I think I need to get the word out there about uh, something that happened to me a few days ago. So, um, I've been doing a lot of researching lately, trying to help grow my channel and stuff, and um, I've come across a, a video that talks, uh, several videos that talk about the Creative Commons license that, uh, that YouTube's offers where you can, you can, uh, you can put your license for, for your videos with Creative Commons, which allows other people to download your content and reuse your content if they want to use it on their channels. That's the whole point of the license so that people can re, uh, can allow other people to reuse their, uh, content. Well, uh, Flair which is one of the big uh, YouTubers that does a lot of fishing videos and stuff like that. His videos are all uh, Creative Commons. Now, I'm pretty sure that uh, Flair already aware that his uh, content can be reused. So, I'm, I'm pretty sure he doesn't really care about it. Anyways, so what happened to me the other day is I joined this uh, Texas uh, Texas Fishing YouTube channel, uh, a group on uh, Facebook. Has a few thousand users or something like that. And... Uh, I got in there and I started sharing my channel and other guys would get me to, uh, to sub to their channel. We were doing like a sub to sub type of thing. And then uh, about the next day, I get a message from the admin of the uh, Facebook group. And he's like, uh, hey, we need to talk. So uh, I sent him a message like, what can I help you with, buddy? He's like, we need to talk about copyright. I was like, all right, well, what do you want to know about it? He's like, well, you got copyrighted videos on your website, and I've contacted Flair to let Flair know that you're uh, that you're using his content. I was like, well, I don't I don't think you really understand the way the license work is. Uh, that his videos are under Creative Commons license, and uh, I'm allowed to use his videos if I please to do so. He's like, it doesn't work like that. Uh, he's got copyright on them videos, and you're not allowed to have that on your channel. And uh, then he sends me a message back, and he's like, uh, "Well, uh, I just removed you from the group, uh, and you're banned from uh, you're banned from my Facebook uh, my Facebook page uh, from the the group that I was just I just got through joining." He's I was like, uh, "Oh, really? Now?" I said, "So you're going to be childish and kick me from a group uh, because you disagree with something that I'm doing that's not actually uh, that actually not illegal in any way." And I even posted him a a, a link to the. To the Creative Commons uh, web uh, webpage off of Google's uh, website that talks about what you can do and what you can't do with a, uh, a Creative Commons uh, video, and uh, he he sends me a message, some smart messages like, uh, "Well, I don't know why you're still arguing." Like he he thinks he's still right. So I wanted to get a message out to everyone. If you're in this uh, Texas fishing YouTube group, uh, the, the the admin of that group is a douchebag, and. Um, he pretty much treated me like shit because uh, I, I uploaded some videos that he didn't feel I should be able to do, even though YouTube allows me to do so. And he claimed that Flair um, filed a copyright claim against me on, on the video that I uploaded. And from the research that I've seen, uh, you have 48 hours to file a claim, or it takes about 48 hours for YouTube to look into it. And it's been three days now, and the video's still on my channel. He was talking out. My channel was gonna, the video was gonna get removed and there was a chance that I could get banned from my channel. My channel was gonna get banned and all that. And, uh, and, and all this crap that he was trying to say that, uh, was gonna happen to me. And then he's just so mad that I'm using videos that, uh, that aren't mine. And so he banned me. He kicked me from the, uh, Facebook group and he banned me from it. This is, uh, Texas Fishing YouTube, uh, Facebook group. So if you guys are part of this group, just know that the admin is a douchebag, and um, he doesn't like to be wrong. So if you ever share somebody else's content, even though you got the right to and he finds out about it, he's going to kick you from the group. So anyways, I don't recommend this group to anyone. I think the guy's an asshole, and uh, he, also, he, he doesn't deserve a chance to uh, be running a group like this. He's letting some power get to his head, and he's being a complete asshole about it. And anyways, that's my rant. I normally don't do videos like this, but this guy's a complete ass. And I think that people need to know about him. So uh, I'm making this video just so you guys know what's going on with uh, why I was kicked from the channel. Because there were several people from the from that YouTube group that uh, followed me. And we subbed each other. And then I get kicked out. And then there, people may be wondering why, why my 
comment's not there anymore. My, my channel's not being shared. Anyways, that's what happened. I don't know what's, what this guy's problem is, but he really needs to change his attitude. He doesn't have the business uh, treating people like this. But uh, there's nothing I can do about it. I mean, even if uh, he unbanned me from the group, I wouldn't join the group because I don't want to be a part of something like that. But anyways, that's the story behind why I was removed from the group. I hope you guys have a great day and uh, tight lines. And uh, if this video uh, helped you in any way, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Or consider subscribing anyways. I give some pretty good content. And uh, until next time, guys, we'll see you in the next video.